Welcome to Show Me Creeks. I'm Larry, and uh, we're going to go float a section of river that I haven't floated before. Uh, everything's pretty low around here. I'm actually expecting this area to be a little low even, but I'm hoping to get on some nice smallmouth. It's really crystal clear water. Uh, it is like 11 o'clock right now. Probably won't get on the water till like noon, so it's a lot later than I'd like to start. Let's see, it might just be a tough bite since we're starting so late, but we're going to get in here and see if we can get a couple of them anyway. I'm going to try not to be you throwing around a rooster tail because, uh, well, I'm going to catch a bunch of nice bass, and I'm pretty sure there's some nice ones in here. So let's get on in here and see what we can get. I'm not quite sure exactly what I'm going to be throwing around. I got a couple of things tied on, of course, but I would have to assume in this area we're probably going to be getting around to the 15 inch range on the smallmouth. So I'd like to get a couple of those and, you know, maybe get some of the real big ones. Let's get this 20 fish day started here. deepen up here i'm not gonna pitch nothing we're gonna stop here this is real nice all right well i wanted to avoid the old rooster tail but this area is way too pretty and there's way too many little fish here to not give it a cast or two so i'm gonna throw it in here and see if we can't catch something and then as we get down, further down the river here we'll end up putting on a, a bigger bait but yeah this water is way down too but look at all these little small mouth they all chased that thing I wish I could get them to chase it from further out. Oh, that one hit it and I missed it. There it is. Get that net wet too here. There we go. I just don't want you flopping around too much. Beautiful little guy. He'll grow up to be big one day. Let's go ahead and let it go. <laughs> A little thumb sucker. small mouth here let's let this guy go okay got a nice one from over there Yeah. Well, I'm definitely glad I put on this rooster tail. Holy cow. Look at that thing. I know, right? On, on that little rooster tail. Yeah. Let's take a look at it first. What a beauty, man. Wow. Let's measure him. Sixteen. Sixteen and a quarter. All right. Nice one. A little over sixteen. Let's go ahead and let this guy go. Well, that's pretty awesome. I'm not going to lie. I'll probably just keep this rooster tail on. Let's head on downstream and see what we can get. Look at this stuff. There we go. little guy here we'll just toss him back gone
This looks real good over here. Something chasing it. Can it get it? Oh. Wow, there's some good sized green sunfish. Huh, I wouldn't mind catching one of them at least. It's like they don't start chasing it until five feet from the kayak. There we go. This one got it. <laughs> oh, wow. Very pretty, huh? Yeah. Very pretty. This thing is bright, buddy. The hook comes out real easy. Oh. See you later. Nice. Oh, I don't even know where he's at. Oh. <laughs> okay. The old rooster tail again. I mean, to be fair, it's all I've thrown since it started catching fish. I'm not changing it too much today. They seem to like it, so. And I like that they like it. Hmm. Beautiful little pattern. Not very long, it's just real quick. Yeah, 11 inches. There we go. Beautiful. Gosh. These are some really nice looking ones, you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Long ear. Look at this one. Another pretty one. Like real pretty. This is red, red boy. Beautiful. Watch that smallmouth eat that thing now. Hmm. Okay, I assume these are different sexes is why they're so different colors. I'm not sure. If you know, let me know. Pretty. Well, this is the kind of risky run floating these little creeks like this. A couple of trees over in the way, and now we get to carry our kayaks over them. But, you know, that's what you do to get some nice bass. We're going to get on here. Or go get through this uh, tree jam up here and uh, you know get back to fishing. Fish right here too. <laughs> He's trying to shake it off of there. Little dude. <laughs> yeah. Pretty though. Look at all those trees we had to come through. That's the risk. It's worth it though. As long as you make it. We're lucky it was shallow through there. If it's deep, that's when it's really tough. Oh. Nice. Pretty. Let's go ahead and toss them back. Mm. 
There's a couple of them. Hmm. Missed it. I'll be quicker than that. No. Oh. Okay. Sitting over there munching. This guy's been caught before. Already had a hole in his nose. Beautiful though. Red eyes. Toss it back. There we go. Got him with the old orange rooster tail here. Easy there. Beautiful. Oh. I mean, Tubby feeding up big time. Go get him, bud. All right, well, that little spot paid off well. Let's go uh, keep on moving downstream, see what we can get. I think I'm going to just keep using the rooster tail and uh, that little swim bait. I think I'm well, got a little winning combination here. I don't even know how many I called already. He don't even care, but it's a good time. Beautiful area too. so fire looking you know still pretty little pale I think that's the female to be honest I think the males are the real bright ones I'm not positive though huh. oh I do have it okay not sure All right, finally, green sunfish joins the party. Nice. Tubby, buddy. These things might be spawning, I'm not even sure. It's pretty shallow through here. I was kind of hoping it would be deeper. Well, we've had maybe two deep holes. Nice one here. Maybe 11 inches. Nothing crazy. There we go. Well, we're just going to drag these kayaks or carry them one down there. Because all this is just too much crap to go through. It's like that all the way around. Either. Oh, very well. This one's a little different. I think this is a hybrid. Whoa. Okay. Hmm. Anyway, I think this is a hybrid. I think it's a bluegill green sunfish. Beautiful though, check out the pattern on it. Hm. Very cool. Are you good here or no? 
Huh? What do you mean? Can I make this? Yeah. Just knocking down spider webs. <clears throat> Buddy, this looks really cool over here. I wouldn't want to get in it though. All these sticks touching your legs kind of freak you out, or it would me. Thanks. Okay. Oh! And spit it out at me. <laughs> you know, you're so funny. There we go. Looks like he's been hooked a bunch. His nose is all kind of stubbed up. Let's toss him back. <laughs> yeah. That was a fighter here. some of that back in I'll never get him he's just slowly taking it away <laughs> beautiful tubby <laughs> let's go ahead and put him back Good one. Put that leech on there. Mm. Oh, buddy. Couldn't resist it. Just could not resist it. Oh. I mean, tough and crazy fight. Nice. Let's put them back. Nice. There it is. Oof. <laughs> he didn't want to get in there. Beautiful. Yeah, you know, nothing crazy. Probably 11 inches or 12, something like that. A lot of fun though. I mean, talk about a fight. This little pole really get a lot of action with it. What happens when you mess around? Scare them off. Here comes one to get it. <clears throat> there you go. Yeah. No, oh, jump with it, buddy. Oh, just come on. The quicker I get you in, the quicker I can get on the next one. No. <laughs> I still take my time with it. Oh, come right out. I love it. They all have really nice pattern. I mean, nothing big. It's bigger earlier. It's kind of crazy, you know? But I did, I have spooked some, so that was good size. 
Long air. Oh boy, what do we have here? That's a good one. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> All right, go on. Oh, easy. Just threw up a crawl, Dad. You did what? Say it just threw up a crawl, Dad. Did it? Yeah. There we go. This is about 13 inches. Still not that big, but I mean, well, you've seen it. Thing was fighting, buddy. Let's put it back. There's another one through here, too. Whew. Man, what a day. Cave right there. I'm not sure if this GoPro will pick it up or not. It's really horrible about picking anything up that's more than 10, 15 feet away. Okay. Got a jumper here. <laughs> nice. I'll take it. Nothing major. Whew. Okay. That one got it. Couldn't help it. <laughs> Another little one on the leech. Well, that's going to do it. Thanks for watching. Wow, what a day. I haven't, I don't know that I've ever had a day that I've caught that many smallmouth. It's pretty awesome. I mean, they weren't all like massive or nothing, but I don't care. Very cool spot. Definitely do it again sometime. But uh, make sure I got a lot more time because we just blew through a bunch of areas, but that's okay. We had a good day. We still seven hours in so anyway we'll see you on the next one